blue. It is a uh, three something a.m. I'll check the clock in a second. Okay, it is uh, three sixteen a.m. I think that's a Bible famous Bible passage. I forget. Like, don't they say like Austin three sixteen and refers to the Bible? Anyways. Uh, I don't feel so good. Basically, uh, I have to wait 45 minutes before I take my anxiety pill, and then uh, I can take another one after that in four hours. And I um, wrote a very long post about that, uh, but I don't think anyone gives a fuck except for me. My fingers hurt. I guess I practiced for three hours yesterday and they haven't healed yet. So yeah, they're sore. Um, I don't think it's anything really to worry about. It, it just means it hurts. <laughs> thermostat was set to 72 degrees Fahrenheit because my parents still use Fahrenheit. I don't know what that is in Celsius, but I find when I turn it up to 75, uh, it either gets bearable or actually comfortable. It's strange, I don't know. And I have to check the back door because I forgot that Melissa I fell asleep before Melissa had to go home, so I don't know if the back door is locked.
to be done before I upload it. Anyway, so uh, I have an hour and a half video that's processing and I've already uh, processed it twice using different methods and it failed both times and I'm doing it now and it's like, a th it, it's something that takes like three hours <laughs> and uh, uh, so, so it'll take like, so already for three hours I had to wait while it was doing its thing, and then when I see check to see if it worked, it well, it did not work. And uh, so it's it, this is the third time that it's going for three hours doing this. I restarted the computer in the hope that it would um, help, um, and uh, yeah, I hope it works. <laughs> I, okay, so I wrote this really long post about clonazepam, but there's something I'd like to add. Um, I think either my doctor or my nurse or someone would we were talking about clonazepam and uh, how it relieves anxiety and uh, I was saying like, Doc, I'm not sleeping, it's really fucking me up. And she says, oh, maybe you're just a night person and we both know you need to cut down on caffeine. And, uh, so anyways, we were talking about clonazepam and I was describing how and why I use it. And then she said, oh, oh yeah, and is it is, you, you're probably also using it, like, to get hot. I, I don't know how she said it, but, like, it's like a drug. It, it is a drug. It's like, <laughs> it's, I, I don't know if you can tell how I'm talking now. I'm talking like a junkie because I need the clonazepam to feel normal, um, which is a bad thing. But uh, she, she was saying, like, oh, it makes you feel good or something like that, like, as in like, you know, weed makes you feel good, or like, beer makes you feel good. And I said, yes, that's true, but like, are you, are you not paying attention to the fact that I was basically bullied into taking this clonazepam, <laughs> like, by, by the people who were now accusing me of taking it as like something to get high? And I'm like, yeah, I, I do take it to get high, but <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't want to be on it. <laughs> like it's it's like if your pot dealer is says like, oh, you get stoned, right? And you, you, all you do is get stoned and do nothing. Like if your pot dealer said that to you, and you're like, yeah, because of the pot you are currently selling me. <laughs> like <laughs> that being said, um, if my doctor suddenly said, okay, we're gonna have to force you off it, um, maybe that would be good, but also that would be very, very bad, <laughs> because I kind of very, very much need it, and I hate the drug, and it's my hope that, um, I hope that I'll get to the point where whatever underlying anxiety, I think I have this underlying anxiety because I had a psychotic episode, uh, or manic episode, or a break from reality, what, whatever you want to call it. I didn't hurt anyone, but my brain was acting crazy. Uh, I also quit alcohol, so I, I hope, like, the fact that I'm still dealing with the fact that I went crazy, like, I don't know. I, I, I don't want to condescend to people who have never gone crazy and say, you have no idea what it's like, like, 
I'm sure you can imagine, but just basically everything, it's like everything you think you know is true. You're, it's almost like being in a different world. And I, okay, I, I can't describe it, but whatever stereotypical um, idea you have in your head about how a crazy person thinks, I was feeling that, and so I'm not feeling that anymore, but uh, the pill I'm on helps with the alcohol, and it also helps with the fact that, like, holy shit, what was that that I just went through? You know, that kind of feeling. I'm probably not very funny right now. <laughs> smart and wise from education and there's a lot of things they just like they they're smart they know things and I I'm sure they do well one of my doctors admitted she did no research on me Melissa said maybe that's good but anyways um the amount of ignorance they have I, I, I'm I, 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 I got it out of me, I don't have to say anything more, just...
remembered I have not done C, uh, so I'll do that after B. the idea of autism, I, I think um, I'm speaking in terms of like the internet's perception or a mockery of autism about obsessively doing something and uh, being uh, intellectually ignorant about other things. Uh, I think uh, oh, this is going to sound like an article written by a 40 year old anyways. But <laughs> The, uh, I think uh, musicians, um, what, if they're good, I, uh, okay, for, forget all that, just what I'm doing, like, if, I know three hours a day isn't that much comparatively, like, a lot of people work eight hours a day, or, like, whatever, uh, anyways, um, 
if what I do continues to the point where I'm like doing it all the time, um, and I, uh, uh, that would make me good, that would make me a proper musician if I was like, I don't, anyways. Uh, I think you can be a proper musician and probably practice only an hour a day, but at any rate, if I were to say, practice eight hours a day every day, seven days a week, whatever, or even more than eight hours, like, like really get obsessed with it, I would be really good at music.